This is the film pack. The film pack is one of my favorite packs that we have. There are a ton of options for you to use here. We have um, some textures that are really weathered and oxidized and old looking. There's cracks and scratches. And then we also have some that are more gritty, grainy and hazy. They're great for putting on top of each other, overlaying, using multiple textures to create the look that you're going for, or you can use them just as a single. So if we look at this first image here, so I've used the dust texture, and I've set that to soft light and added a mask on top. So this is the image beforehand. This is the image after. It's just added a little bit of noise. It's pulled down some of the exposure a little bit, created a nice vignette on the image. This is what it looks like without the mask. So you can see on her face that uh, there's a lot of noise on her arm and on her face, so I've just masked that out. And again, it's personal preference. For the next image that we have, we've gone a little more extreme, so I've used three textures here. So this is Obscura, Haze, and Scratch. And for Obscura, I've set it to soft light and masked. And for Haze, I've used hard light and lowered my opacity and masked. And for Scratch, I've used Multiply, lowered my opacity, and I've also masked that as well. So this is the image before, and this is the image after. So the intention here was just to create an old, weathered looking image. I'll show you without the masks and with the masks. The reason I've masked off where I have is because I feel like I want his eyes to pop, I want his face to pop. So this has been the film pack. Again, I'm really excited for this one. So if you're looking for hazy and scratched and oxidized or you know, just looking to put some age on your images, I think this is perfect. I can't wait to see what you guys come up with and share uh, with us in the Facebook community.